Hi, I'm Nick Belayef. I'm the VP Production for Spin Master, and we're here today at E3 to talk about Airhogs Connect Mission Drone. So explain how this toy is connecting through augmented reality to a video game world. Sure. Um, what we're doing is we're trying to blend physical play with digital play, and augmented reality is really the, the cornerstone that allows that to do it. So we, uh, it's, it's really a three-part system. So we have a mat that you put on the ground, and the mat, uh, your mobile device, and smartphone or tablet, Android or iOS, will recognize that, hey, this is the thing that I should draw the augmented reality world. Uh, it's a virtual world, so it ends up being a lot larger than the mat. Um, and then we have a blob tracker system that recognizes the, uh, the LEDs uh, on this drone and it tracks it in the real world and then we have a flight control system that maps the real world into the virtual reality world. So our app is the enabler between the digital and the physical. So. Within the world, there's an alien invasion happening right now. Uh, in the mission drone, you have uh, four different people. Uh, you are the pilot in charge of uh, navigating this, this rough alien world. Um, you also have a commando that jumps out of the drone, fights aliens, rescues civilians. You then have an engineer with a grappling hook. Uh, the grappling hook you can use to uh, also rescue civilians, pick up alien uh, husks, as well as return the command to the the ship. Finally, you have an engineer, uh, sorry, a firefighter, and the firefighter has a water can and then he uses to put out burning buildings. Um, if you do run out of water, you can go into any water surface within the game, refill the ship, and uh, you know, be the hero. Talk a little about the types of missions and how deep the game is. Sure. Um, we, we have over 30 scripted missions dealing with the onboarding process. If you're a new drone flyer, it introduces you to the concept of flying drones. If you're an expert drone flyer, you can just blaze right through it. Uh, and then past that, we have uh, endless play mode, where it's procedurally generated missions across three different environment sets. Um, we also have the concept of uh, powered play and recharge mode, because Everything is centered around the physical play of the RC and extending it into the video game world. We're always making sure that we're keeping contact with that physical digital connection. So we have um, the Danger Dome, and it's our training room. Uh, there's four different uh, segments within the Danger Dome, one for each of the characters in the drone. It teaches you advanced techniques for each one, and it also unlocks power-ups. So. Uh, Within that, you're also doing endless waves. So the more waves that you can finish for each character within a timer, the better unlocks you get. Um, if you're gonna rank up your squad from rank one to rank 15, level up all four research buildings from level one to level 10 each, and unlock the over uh, 40 unlockables and skins and chassis for the drone, uh, that takes our testers that actually get to play a full eight hours a day and not worry about recharge time over a week. Uh, so there's, there's, it's, it's a tremendously deep game. We didn't want to do anything shallow. We want to make sure that we're, we're legit. We believe that uh, players today are just so sophisticated that they want something that's a deep and compelling experience that they can just sink into. Are there any multiplayer? Uh, drone is really sort of a solitary experience, so we have worldwide leaderboards so you can see how you're competing against the rest of the world. We also have friend leaderboards, but there's no multiplayer. What's the price and launch date? Uh, we're coming out this fall at 149